colors are the foundation or the base of any capsule wardrobe color palette. There are many different ways you can wear neutrals and that is why neutrals are an essential part of a capsule wardrobe. If you incorporate other colors in your outfits, like say for example reds, blues, and greens, some color tones may not coordinate well, therefore limiting your outfit combinations. Because neutrals are not colors, but actually shades, they can mix and match with each other and they mostly always blend well together. Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Nina and I hope you stick around and watch my future videos. And for those of you who are returning subscribers, thank you so much for watching this video. For this first look, I am wearing the Wilfred Patara t-shirt in heather oat beige as well as the tiered leaning long skirt in natural color and I'm pairing this look with this Chloe C bag in taupe color. You really can't go wrong with a monochromatic look and I think this look is very effortlessly chic and very simple to put together. This is such a very relaxed and comfortable look and perhaps you can call it an everyday look and this is something I could definitely wear going out during the day with the kids. For this second look, I am wearing a white bodysuit from Express and a pleat straight trousers in Ecro as well as this beige straw bag clutch. Complete this look with this women's dryer woven high heel side sandals from Mark Fisher in light natural leather. This is such a great look for any lunch date or any date look. I think that the white bodysuit is such a great piece to pair it with this pleat straight trousers. These two pieces create such a great balance of a fitted top as well as loose pants. This next look is actually one of my favorite look. I think that this look creates a longer figure and gives me that slimming effect. I am wearing a crop top linen from Zara as well as a linen and cotton wide leg pants from Allison New York and I paired this look with this Stuart Witzman wedges in white and it has that gold hardware on it. This high-waisted long pants provide that slimming effect as well as that longer looking legs. This is something I could wear in a lunch or dinner date. This look is an epitome of classy, elegant, and sophisticated look. This next look is giving me that vacation or tropical vibe. I am wearing a tomboy shirt in Ecro Blue Dots from Cezanne as well as this linen pants in Ecro Color from Mango. I paired this look with a straw bag and a straw hat and I finished this look with this white slide sandals from Chanel. Okay, now I'm ready for a vacation. Tying a knot in a button-down shirt is giving me that casual, chic look. Button-down shirts are super classy but sometimes feel a little too dressed up for a roundhouse or everyday look. So that's why I decided to tie a knot and also roll the sleeves to give me that casual look. By the way, please give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, I would really, really appreciate if you do so. I paired this look with this vintage inspired woman's straw hat from Artagia Chameleon. And it has that five changeable color bands with snapback closure to complement fabulous outfits. 
this is such a very relaxed and comfortable look that is probably something I could wear with any lunch date or going out with friends. This next look is perhaps the most casual outfit of all the looks on this video. I am wearing a white button-up shirt from Paula Ralph Lauren as well as this mock wide leg linen pants in black and I paired this items with this Chloe bag in taupe color. I've decided to tuck the front of my shirt as well as roll the sleeves to give me that very casual look. I paired the items with this ribbon straw hat in sand color from Mango. I finished this look with this Jacqueline Spadrill platform sandal in black from Steve Madden. Although the sandals has the 2 inches heel platform, it is very comfortable and it's giving me the earthy texture and summery style to a breezy sandal. Wearing a loose button-up shirt and this loose pants can easily make this look frumpy. But I've decided to roll the sleeves and tuck the front shirt in as well as wear the straw hat to give this look more elevated. Now let's talk about wearing neutral colors for night look. I am wearing a white bodysuit blouse from Express and this high-waisted pleated skirt. And with this Artemis belt in smooth heritage camel from Cezanne. I have decided to wear the belt at the narrowest part of my waist to create the hourglass figure that I don't have. The Artemis belt in camel color provides the perfect contrast of this white monochromatic look. Wearing high heels and clutch bag makes this outfit dressy. Let me know in the comment below which of this look is your favorite and which of this look you actually will incorporate into your style. Let's talk about this linen vest in acro color that I've actually chosen to wear it as a dress in this look. This linen dress or linen vest actually has that v-neck. It is a sleeveless and it has that adjustable belt which is also made of 100% linen. And I think wearing this gray taupe bag is actually perfect in pairing with this dress and I've decided to wear this dark camel color flat sandals to give contrast to this entire outfit. Depending on your dress code at work, I think that this is something you could wear at work. You may also choose to wear a low heel pumps or shoes. But I think this ballerina flat shoes from Terry Birch look professional and polished. This flats will also look stylish when worn with pants or jeans if your office is more casual. And most importantly, flats are the ultimate comfy work shoe whether you're commuting on foot or standing a lot when you're on the job. For this next outfit, I've decided to change the look but keep the dress at the same time. So I have changed the linen belt into this leather belt as well as changed the leather flat shoes with this flat spadrill shoes. I am also wearing this Chloe mini bag in taupe color. Now these three items that I've changed actually do provide a much casual look. For the next look, I think this is more of an edgy style. I am wearing a asymmetrical blouse from Express with the belt that actually gives me that cinch waist. I am pairing this blouse with this high-waisted distress denim in white from Express as well. Pairing these two items with this structured bag make this look to the next level. 
I love this look on me and I think you can never go wrong with a monochromatic look. Although I am wearing a flat slide sandals, I think this outfit still looks elegant, sophisticated, and classy at the same time. This outfit can be easily transitioned into a very casual business branch look if I change my slide sandals into flat shoes or low heel pumps. Let's move along on how I would wear neutral colors while wearing shorts. I am wearing an oversized poplin shirt from Zara as well as linen short from Saks Fifth Off. Because this poplin shirt is oversized, I've decided to wear a leather belt to give me that cinch waist. I can probably also wear a blazer, but that's just too hot for summer. But perhaps a linen blazer would be okay. I've also decided to unbutton the lower half of this shirt as well as the upper buttons. That way you can see a little bit more of this high-waisted linen shorts and you can also see a little bit more of my skin on top so the material of this shirt is not too overwhelming on me. I've also decided to roll the sleeves to give me that casual look and I paired this outfit with this trainer shoes or veja shoes to make this outfit a little bit more casual. And I think pairing this outfit with this mini coach bag is perfect because one it matches my belt and two it actually gives contrast to this entire outfit all right so we made it now we are on the last look so for this last look i am wearing a strap dress with removable belt but i've chosen to use a leather belt instead that i got from gucci Navy blue is the new neutral, paired it with just about any color. A nice change from black, gray, or brown, or the usual dark neutrals. I wanted to match the color of my belt, so I decided to wear my trainer shoes or my Veja shoes. And wearing this Chloe bag in top color provides a perfect contrast and creates a perfect balance on the entire outfit. 